afternoon. I'm Lieutenant Rob Schoonover. This is a follow-up of a murder investigation that occurred back in January of 2011. Michelle McCoy, 22-year-old black female, was reported missing January 13th of 2011. In 2000, uh, February, of, February 3rd of 2011, her body was recovered in the 3900 block of Revolt River Lane. Yesterday, detectives went down to Suwannee Correctional Institution and transported Kenneth Lee Thompson, black male 26, back to Jacksonville and charged him with murder and kidnapping in the death of Michelle McCoy. I'll entertain any questions. What, what changed between February 3rd uh, of more than a year ago and yesterday decided to charge him? Thompson was arrested and charged with robbery back in 2011. It's related to this incident. The state went ahead with the trial on the robbery charges, and once that was complete, he was sentenced, sent, he was receiving life for the robbery. Then the decision was made to bring him back and charge him with the murder and kidnapping and to proceed with that charge. Maybe help people understand what uh, the sentencing was, I think, in May, if, if my memory serves. So what's the delay or, or what goes into that process of taking since May until now to say, okay, it's related, now we're going to charge you with murder and, and kidnapping? I don't want to get into how the state does their, you know, handling of their cases, but I'm sure they got to look at their calendar and see what events are going on and then uh, plan accordingly. So he's already serving life, so this will just be the official charge added on to his list of charges? Yes. And will he be serving life still in Swannies? No, uh, I do not know. Have you had contact with the family uh, for Michelle McCoy and what's their reaction like? I have not. I'm sure my lead detective, Brett Hoagland, has been in contact with them. And I'll be honest with you, I can't tell you what they, what they feel or what they said. Okay. Any other questions? You said you don't want to get the state's process, but why not charge back in 2011? At that time, you got to look at the circumstances of the case and what, uh, what, what we had and what we were doing to the state. And the robbery was a strong charge. I'm not saying that the murder is not, but that was one to proceed with, get that out of the way. Lieutenant, is there a motive that you established? What's the reason for the killing? We believe Kenneth and Michelle were acquaintances. They knew each other. She was in possession of a stolen item, a phone. And we believe he was trying to get that phone back for whatever reason that night. Him and Larry Thompson, you all are familiar with Larry, he killed himself in a, uh, a SWAT call out back in uh, 2011. Whatever happened out there that night, they, uh, they blunt force trauma and killed her and buried her in the ground. Any other questions? Okay. Thank you. Thank you.